Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Welcome to my home. Welcome to my channel. Oh, it's Saturday night. It's been a fantastic day. It was 85 degrees today. Spent the day outside. It was just amazing. Just really, really nice. And I just want to thank you guys for allowing me to bother you on a Saturday night, even though I have no idea what day I'm going to post this. But um, I just want to just thank you guys again for your support. You guys are amazing. And oh my gosh, you guys mean the world to me. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you are new to my channel, I hope you click on that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. And today we are doing my April Look Fantastic box here. Beauty Beyond Boundaries. So Look Fantastic. This is from the UK and shipping is fast. Shipping is free. Um, in this, it's $21 a month. Um, I think it's night it was twenty one dollars a month, but when I got it, there's like different tiers, so I think I signed up for the one for nineteen dollars a month. Um, I did use somebody's link, so I got my first box for a dollar, and I did sign up to get it for a year to check this out. In it, you're going to get five deluxe samples. They say the value is about sixty dollars. Alrighty, so excited to get into this. The cover is so so pretty this month, and I think this. What's there a saying in here? I didn't do this to my other box. There is no there is no force more powerful than a woman determined to rise. Alrighty, and then you do get the little booklet here. And it's gonna kinda be like a magazine type format where there's uh different notes in here. It's gonna totally show you the different items that you could get. Sometimes there's different choices in here. Like when it says 5.1 or 5.2, you either get get one or the other. And then there's just different articles. Interesting looking in here. So let's get into it, shall we? Alrighty, so the inside of the box, we just have the look fantastic tissue paper and seal. And what the inside of my box looks like. Good things that fell out of it. I just get a lot of this squirrely paper in here too. So really fun items. So let me get my handy dandy book over here. So first thing I see here is the first aid. Little puff pad in here. The facial radiance pads helps exfoliate, tone, and brighten. So there's 10 pads in here, and it looks like it's resealable right there. And this is probably not going to show with that shine, but it looks like you had a choice of getting one or the other. So we got 5.1 and 5.2. And so I got the facial pads that's infused with ingredients to promote a natural, healthy glow to your complexion, suitable for daily use. They work to reduce the look of pores and fine lines whilst, I love that word, whilst brightening and smoothing the skin. Safe to use on even the most sensitive skin types. It's got lactic acid, glycolic acid, cucumber, lemon peel, and licorice root. Use one pad to wipe over face, neck, and decollete. Follow with your favorite moisturizer. Alrighty, and then the other item that some people might have got would have been the fast absorbing facial moisturizer. Okay, so either one's good. I've never had these before, so nice to try. Okay, blossom and bloom. I'm not sure what this is yet. Apply with clean fingers to skin that needs extra attention. For external use only. Well, I don't think people line the inside of their mouth with things, do they? It's a bounty tasking bomb. Alrighty, so what is it? So it's a versatile, skin loving wonder bomb filled with a blend of nourishing ingredients to condition and hydrate your skin. Whether you're suffering from chapped lips, dry hands, or have a little one in need of extra soothing the natural bomb can help 
rich in anti-inflammatory properties to protect, condition, and treat even the most delicate skin. Castor seed oil, lavender oil, olive fruit oil, vitamin E, and shea butter. Squeeze a small amount on fingertips and massage wherever needed. Interesting. Interesting. I'll say that. Interesting. Alrighty. So let's see what this is. So this is Polar Cream. Some kind of hydration cream, I'm going to say. Ice source. Moisturizing cream. I'm not sure if the back is going to show. So uh, let's go to the book and see what this is. This is item seven. It says a cooling ingredient treatment that will leave your skin feeling hydrated and refreshed, combining three active ingredients. This face mask, okay, it's a face mask. I never would have got that from the packaging. Okay, this face mask nourishes your complexion by warding off dryness and dehydration. Its uplifting scent will also revitalize your senses. Iceberg water, hyaluronic acid, something from the Antarctica. Massage into slightly damp skin after your bath or shower until fully absorbed. That's not really a mask, is it? Okay, well, we'll, we'll give it a go. Sounds interesting. I'm game. I'll give it a go. Alrighty, so we have something in a little jar. You can see what this is. So if I can find the front of it. Christopher Robin. It's a regenerating mask with rare prickly pear seed oil from Paris. Let's have some ingredients in there. Apply a small amount after shampooing. Oh, it's for your hair. Massage from scalp to ends. Add water. Leave in for two to three minutes. Then rinse. You know, I'm glad I read that because I thought this was a face mask. Hashtag Nancy has no idea. It is full to the brim, too. Plus, it does have the directions in here, too, right? And it smells really nice, too. Okay. Christopher Robin. I thought it was skincare. But it sounds really good, so I'm excited about this. Alrighty, looks like we've, maybe it's a bar soap. I have a Dead Sea Mud Mineral Mud Soap. Mud Soap. Mud Soap for body, removes all impurities. Lather and rinse. Okay, expected to look like mud. It just has a kind of a fresh scent. Okay, so let's read what the book says here. Of course, it's on the side that you can't see. Okay, so a purifying soap suitable for use on both the face and body, formulated to wash away dirt and impurities without stripping your skin of its necessary moisture. Dead Sea Mud. Work into a luxurious slather, massage over face and body, and rinse. Okay, I can do that. Easy enough, I can handle that. Okay, and the last. Oh. Okay. Guess we got two things to go. AM to PM. So it's pencil eyeliner. I'm not going to open it. It's sealed and my fingernails are shot. It says it's a pencil eyeliner with a gel finish to add drama and definition to your eye makeup look. 
with a formula that will glide effortlessly, effortlessly over the eyes, avoiding any pull or discomfort, complete with a retractable sharpener to keep the liner in tip-top condition. Swipe across your eye area until desired look is achieved. All right, tells you how to smoke it out too, so that looks pretty cool. All righty, and this is the last item. Looks like an eyebrow brush. Brush. Right. Brush works. It's a dual-ended eyebrow brush to help you achieve the perfect. Oh my gosh, I'm I'm destroying these boxes tonight. I might just ruin both ends. So if this ends up in a giveaway, I'm sorry that I ruined the box on you guys. It is very pretty. So that brush right there. Looks like maybe it just needs to be bent back into shape. I wasn't sure if maybe there was a powder in here, but I think you have to get your own powder. Alrighty, so this was item two. Let's fold this so I can try to read it. So it says it's a dual-ended eyebrow brush to help you achieve the perfect brow with every use. The angled brush works well with both cream and powder products to help you create natural brush stroke with hairs. Okay. Whilst, I love that word, whilst the spoolie end is great to brush through any product and create a fluffy, more feathered brow look. Tell you how to use it. Interesting. Alrighty. So, you know, I don't really use brow products. I mean, I have some, but I very rarely use it because I like to kind of keep my hair in front of my eyes so that you can't see that my eyebrows are really thin and hardly there anymore. But you never know. I, I might use it. And if I give it, you know, put it in a future giveaway, please don't be mad at me about the ripped ends. Alrighty. So again, I don't know the value because they don't list the value. They probably have them on their website, but sometimes for a couple of samples and when you're this far back and behind in boxing, yeah. So anyway, we got that uh, double-ended brow brush. We got the Ahava, the mud soap. I forgot what this one was already. I think it said it was a mask, but you put it on after shampooing and then you rub it in. So to me, that's a moisturizer. Um, this natural balm from Blossom and Blossom, which I probably will just use as a hand lotion. The hair mask, which, or the hair conditioner or hair mask or whatever that I thought was a facial mask, so I'm glad I read the directions before I made a fool of myself. Just for Robin. And then the uh, First Aid brand. First Aid Beauty, the Radiance Facial Pads. Alrighty, so one, two, three, four, five, six items. Oh, seven. The eyeliner pencil, which I know I will use this. I will just probably get a little knife or something to rip that off when I'm ready to use it. But that was everything in here. So, again, I did get some nice products to try and just uh, happy to have this. I just, uh, I need help trying to figure out what things are before I hurt myself or ingest something that I'm not supposed to. Yeah, so I look forward to hearing your comments. Your help, of course, is amazing because hashtag Nancy has no idea. And hashtag Nancy, it's about time you took care of your skin. But anyway, looking forward to this box. And yeah, so um, I've had really good luck with this box too. And again, because um, when you start getting subscriptions, you get first uh, dibs on their limited edition collections like that great, this one had that great big egg. Some really cool items in there. Cool egg. So, anyway, look fantastic. This is the month of April. Looking forward to see what I get in May. Looking forward to putting these products away before my May boxes start coming. Goal. Yeah. So, anyway, take care, everybody. Have a great weekend or a great end of the week or middle of the week or just have a great week, okay? Alrighty. Talk to you guys later. Bye bye.